As the Germans are strengthening their defensive line, ground attack sorties have become more and more common as we try to chip away at their forces near Rajev. On January 17, 1942, we were ordered on one such mission. A supply convoy is heading to the east to bring supplies to the 3rd Panzer Army. We were to take off at 9 a.m. and interdict the enemy. Hello everybody, Wolf back here, and welcome back to our IL-2 Battle of Moscow series. Today we are tasked with doing some ground attack. We are hitting a German resupply convoy that is pretty deep behind enemy lines. They are along this road here, and it looks like they may either turn north or south at this T-junction. We'll see where they are at. We are carrying two 100 kilogram bombs underneath our wings. Uh, see those on our flight lead there, and of course, pretty obvious. I am not leading this flight. However, I am flying in the number two position. So far, it's been a rather quiet morning. Nice and clear. No aircraft or anything like that have been spotted just yet, but there is a good chance we will be intercepted once we cross into German lines. We still have a ways to go, however. We just flew over an airfield. This airfield right here, so... Yeah, and there's a little town off to our left it actually may be that one huh yep because there's the airfield perfect so we are currently at this position we still have what maybe 50 kilometers to go or so quick guess i need to get back into formation here Okay, we are in enemy territory. I just saw some flak up above us. Let's keep our eyes peeled for any more of that. Yep, there's another puff right there. They actually, in the latest patch, have redone quite a few of the effects in the game, and the flak bursts were one of them. They look pretty cool now when they explode, but I'm sure we will get a, <laughs> a closer look at them. Uh, when we go in on the enemy convoy. We should be closing in on the convoy. I'm just waiting for the order to start searching. I'm looking here for a major road. Unfortunately, in winter, it is pretty hard to pick out the roads. Here's a road, though, right underneath us. Oh, geez, where did flight lead go? Oh, he's dropping down. Oh, there they are. Found him. <laughs> Go get them, boys. I didn't get a radio call. Jeez, okay. And there's some of the new explosions. All right. Oh, well, here we go. Suppose we'll make our attack run now. Any anti-aircraft trucks? It's going to be the main threat. It's a pretty long convoy. There's a little half track in the lead there. Yeah, we'll bomb them. Oh shit, fighters. Southeast high, one kilometer. Okay, let's throttle up, roll in and drop our bombs. I do not see the enemy fighters. But I believe them. Okay, the MiGs are going in for their strafing runs. Just strafing that column. Nice work, boys. Okay, get ready to drop. Okay. Just drop one, drop two on the road. Where are these fighters? Let's pick out a 109. I think that's one. Oh my gosh. Shit. Okay, we gotta go. Wow, okay. Uh, this plane is what they call fucked. <laughs> I don't think we're going anywhere. I, I mean, 
Oh gosh. Yeah, I got a couple of trucks though. At least there's that. Canopy. Ouch. Let's try to trim it out a little bit. How's the engine? Our fuel tanks hit. What's that on my six? Oh God! It's a 109. Oh, gosh, we are pretty far behind. Oh shit! There's two of them. <laughs> I was uh, I was contemplating turning towards them, but um, we're going to avoid that. Where's number two? I lost them. I lost number two. Oh, that's because he uh, climbed up. He's coming. Oh shit! Being shot at again. Uh. The heck is this? Not a German truck? Oh, something exploded behind me. It looks like I was just hitting the fuel tank and uh, obviously my wings. The plane is pretty unstable. Yeah, it looks like I'm just leaking fuel. Thankfully, we weren't hitting the radiator or anything like that. That would have been a bit more problematic. Ah, there he is. Oh, he lost me. He's uh, he's a little lost, isn't he? He's 109. I don't think we're going to be able to catch up with all these holes. Pretty, <laughs> not what you would call sleek anymore. Uh, despite calling them speed holes, they do have the opposite effect on speed. <laughs> and the 109 is turning around. Guess he saw me. I don't like that. Head on the uh, 15 or 20 millimeter cannon, whatever variant this guy is. Okay, I've made a mistake. <laughs> I've, I have made a mistake. Okay, where are you going? He's coming for me. Less than ideal. Okay, I see artillery. It's got to be friendly. Let's go say hello. I have no visual on the enemy 109 that's kind of tailing us. May have left. Destroyed BF-109 F2. I killed him? Did I get a hit in that head-on? There's a little flare here. Hello, comrades. Did I kill him? Really? I'm not complaining. I have no idea how. I must have hit him in the head on. Okay, we're going to try to make it all the way home or as close as we can get. The engine seems okay. Thankfully, like I said, just hits in the fuel tank and the wings. I mean, it looks worse than it is. 
So that's the uh, that's the good news. And I guess it was an F2. So it is possible it just had the 15 millimeter cannon, which is certainly underwhelming when you're using it. Okay, we have arrived home and we are coming in for our landing. As you can see, fuel, we're down to like, what, 70 liters maybe? Something like that. So fuel got pretty darn low. Let's throttle back, try to kill off some of our airspeed here. Ready to drop our flaps. And we are dropping off airspeed a little too fast. You're down. All right, looking good, kind of. Nice and easy. Hopefully our brakes and everything still work here. And hopefully this landing isn't a complete failure, but I'm pretty excited that we made it all the way home nonetheless. Okay, all the back. expected there we go and we're down brakes there we go and we are golden time to taxi off and i'll see you all for the debrief and here we go somehow that was a successful mission we were in the air again for an hour so it seems like this is going to be the new mission link. One plane shot down and two transport vehicles destroyed with our bombs, I suppose. That's what we got. Let's go ahead and finish and see how everyone else did. Well, here we are. Everyone made it back home except our flight leader who was actually killed in action. He destroyed one vehicle. Altogether, we destroyed seven transports and one truck. Well, that will conclude today's episode. I hope you all enjoyed it. If you did, please be sure to leave a like and comment as it really does help out the channel. But until next time, this is Wolfpack345 signing off and I'll see you all on the next one.